Angelina Mango is coming. coming. Social media needs to be on point because the mango is landing. That's right, Angelina Mango is here. Bang Ting Viet Nook Swai. That's right, the mango in Vietnamese and English, you name it, girls. Ooh. The live stream is losing it because Angelina Mango has arrived. The beautiful Angelina Mango. Please have a seat. You gorgeous creature, Hi, welcome. Hi. Let me move this closer. First question, yeah. how are you? I'm really fine, I'm good, I'm having fun in this crazy world of Eurovision. Last night, someone on Twitter said she can sing, she can dance, and she can sing and dance at the same time. What is your secret? Well, I have a, a sister that do all the things. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's not me. <laughs> no, you're good. And what's remarkable is you're doing all this cumbia, but the voice is like studio quality. Thank you. Really, are you exercising? Like, what is it? Well, I I take my job uh, uh, very strictly, and uh, I have lots of workouts. I run, and uh, I love the what I, I I love what I do. So, yeah. <laughs> do you eat mango? Uh, yes, but I don't love it. I, I have to, to, to be true. Now, before you entered this beautiful circus, did you have a preconception of Eurovision? Like, how has your thought changed about Eurovision? Mm, a preconception about me at the Eurovision? Let's do that, yeah. Why not? No, I didn't have it, <laughs> absolutely. Uh, I always watched the Eurovision with my mom. Uh, and uh, she's a big fan, uh, but uh, I didn't, um, I've never uh, ima imagined myself uh, on this uh, stage. <laughs> now, the cumbia is such an international dance. People love the cumbia. Yeah. How are you like the cumbia? Uh, well, I think cum cumbia is uh, an important dance because uh, you can dance also on everything that makes you feel sad. And uh, I, I'm, I'm the cumbia. I think I'm the cumbia. Yeah, you <laughs> yes. are. And you are also the sisterhood, because in your music video, women yeah. are braiding your hair. Tell us about this message of women helping each other. Well, I think it's very important. I think that uh, uh, I don't believe in the competition in general. Uh, and I'm very proud to be a woman in this, uh, in this competition because uh, I think woman, women are very strong. And I, I met uh, some uh, artists uh, and some colleagues that uh, I want to learn from. Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. That's Thank beautiful. You. And I must say, we learned from you because at San Remo, when you covered your father's song, it was so emotional, really. Thank you. What was that like for you to be honoring him at San Remo? Well, it was uh, it was very difficult, um, but uh, it was a good thing, the, the right thing, and. Uh, uh, when I was um, uh, on stage uh, and I would start singing, uh, I thought, oh my god, I can do that, I, I can't do that. But then I, I went inside of the song and uh, I think I am um, inside also now, <laughs> so <laughs> I didn't reprise. <laughs> it's just incredible. <laughs> And looking toward Eurovision, we know you're going to have dancers now, yes. other people on stage. Yes. What inspired that? Well, um, I'm very, I'm very honored to to share this experience with Magnun, that is a great choreographer, and uh, with the, these uh, dancers, um, their energy and their personality are very important on stage with me. Because uh, I don't, I don't like to be alone on stage. I hate to be alone on stage. Well, you are not alone because you have all of the Eurovision fans with you, all of the dancers. But is there danger? Like, could your booty bump against the dancer? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> but I guess as a professional, you're very used to working with other dancers. Yeah. Uh, well, I hope to be um, mm, near to them because they are very beautiful and they're professional. Uh, but uh, I want to learn. I want to learn from everything of this experience. And if you win Eurovision, 
No, it's not possible. Oh, no, it is possible, babe. It is possible. <laughs> the mango is real. People love the mango. What city should host? No, I want... Um, <laughs> I want to answer because uh, I think it's not possible. Uh, I'm sorry. I must say, we believe in you. We love you. And there are 1,200 people watching who have questions for you. Hi. It's Wow, this is amazing. And one question people keep asking is what is what are some of your favorite songs of 2024 Eurovision? Ooh, that's very difficult for me. Uh, I really love uh, Norway. I really love uh, Poland. I really love... Uh, um, Ukraine um, and Spain. Oh, I I can learn from everything here and from everyone. I'm too young to have uh, opinions. <laughs> How do you avoid boredom? Well, I don't have lots of boredom in my life uh, in this period. Uh, but uh, um, I just uh, think that boredom is something good when it comes because you can concentrate on yourself and uh, on your uh, sensation and uh, it's important just for some time to uh, take up the phone and uh, think about ourselves and uh, breathe. That is such good advice. Final question yeah. for you. Final question. What do you want people to remember about Angelina Mango after Eurovision? Well, I want people to remember about me that uh, I am a free girl and um, I love music and uh, I just want to be myself on stage without masks, without uh, doing anything else. Um, I want to... I want to be uh, free for every young girl that uh, watch me from home, at home. That's a beautiful message. Peel the mango, <laughs> remove the layers and keep it real. We love you so much. Grazie mille. Grazie te. We wish you only luck and love. Thank you. Thank you. I'm gonna get a photo with my girl real quick. She is incredible. Your song makes me move. Three, two, one. You're amazing. Thank you. And so is this beautiful creature. Thank you, as always, for all your help. <laughs> oh. Have a nice day.